Some of the youngest people in our community are tackling a huge challenge right now, ending child homelessness in King County. The Kids Helping Kids Summer Coin Drive kicks off tomorrow, and joining me now is child advocate and musician Casper Baby Pants and some very special friends. Thanks for being here, you guys. Thanks for having us. Okay, well, let's start over there, Casper, with the guitar. Yes. Talk about the summer project. Well, it's called Kids Helping Kids, and the idea is that we want to get coin jars, official Kids Helping Kids coin jars, into the hands of small children who can canvass their neighborhoods, friends, family, uh, and raise money and donate it to Wellspring Family Services to uh, prevent homelessness in King County, get a taste for philanthropy, and every participant will be entered into a random drawing to win their very own custom Casper Baby Pants original hit song. At the end, on September 1st, we draw. Wow, so, motivation right there for yeah. all of our young viewers. They're probably freaking out in their living room because ah. you're a rock star in, <laughs> in our midst. Casper Baby Pants, you will know him if you don't, well, if you have kids, you know him already. That's true. So it's a pretty cool contest happening this summer. And um, Rena Matasia, how much, <coughs> how much have you collected? 506 pennies. Five, no, no, $506. dollars in <laughs> pennies, is that right? <laughs> That's a whole lot more. Was it fun? Yeah. Really? You did a great job. That's incredible, all by yourself. So just imagine how much people can raise if we all do it together. Now tell us, you guys have a special story, don't you, Mom? Uh, yeah. Um, Wellsprings Family Services helped us at a point in our life that we were having some difficulties. Mm -hmm. And um, we wanted to tell our story. Um, they asked us to. And um, so we ended up, we started off as clients with them. But they had, they have an early learning program that had turned 20 years old, two million pennies, um, twenty thousand dollars for the early learning program. Rena Matasia took the jug, started collecting money, and when she went to turn in the money, she knew someone. So one of her friends was in the program. So that touched her heartstring, and she jug by jug she collected over five hundred and six dollars in pennies. You must be so proud. Yes, I am. And the kickoff officially starts tomorrow, so you're, you are really ahead of everybody else here. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, well, actually, her and 60 first graders at South Shore uh, K-8 school um, have already uh, collected money um, as a project. They found out about homelessness. They pulled together and collected money. So we even have an early start because their school, um, because she asked, decided to uh, contribute to You must be children. so proud, Sabrina. I am very proud. I, I always wanted her to give back to the community, but I never imagined it would happen at such a young age. You know, what is it that you want her to learn? Um, I think she already knows it. I think she learned it, but that every person can make a difference from right where they stand, and it doesn't matter how old or young you are. We can always do something to help another person. You know, and, and you guys have, have one story. Just imagine how many different stories are out there in our own community. Um, Casper, why is this so important to you personally? Well, because my mission uh, when I'm making music for kids and families is to lower stress. And it's so important for me because I can't imagine anything more stressful than, <coughs> you know, the threat of losing your home. Uh, so my partnership with Wells, Wellspring is really based on, you know, stress reduction for uh, not healthy families and for families in crisis. So that's where we, that's our common ground. It is a very important cause and it all stays local right here in King County. We're running out of time, but before we go, can you send us off with a very popular tune? Yeah. A little snippet perhaps? Well, this is this is the song that I wrote originally for Rena Matasia. It's the very first Kids Helping Kids <laughs> song and there's already been one winner last summer. So this is, it's called Happy Heart. I took a shiny penny, penny, put it in a jar. I grew that shiny penny, penny, grew it with my heart. One plus one is two, I know, and that is where you start. I took a shiny penny, penny, put it in a jar. Woo. We all have our own little something, something, all have a way to shine. We all have our own little something, something, love so true and fine. Spare a penny here and there like flowers on a vine. We all have our own little something, something, a love so true and fine. We all have our own little something, something, a love so true and fine. We all have our own little something, something, a love so true and fine. Woo! <laughs> Thank you so much, you guys. For more information, just go to our website, comonews.com, and click on Como4TV. The buzz is next. Thank you so much.